Hello and welcome back to another tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to connect JotForm to Google Drive. So the first things first, the first things, I'm off to a great start. Pay no attention to the time of which I'm recording this. First things first, you'll need to log into JotForm. I have already done that. Then you'll need to come over to plugins and underneath plugins, click apps. Next, well, I mean, there's a Google Drive right there, but there's a few different connections for uh, Google Drive. So I'm just gonna search it, but there's a handful of other connections of which you can do for JotForm. I'm just showing you Google Drive, but on this page, I'm showing you that there is a plethora of other things. Point is there's a lot of integrations and in this particular video, I'm showing Google Drive. I'm going to go ahead and search Google Drive and we get like three of them that are actually Google Drive. I have no idea what the heck this one is. This one doesn't belong. I don't know why it's here, but it doesn't belong. That's all I know. We are then going to click Google Drive integration. You're gonna click add to form. It's gonna load. We're gonna create a new form, apparently. We're going to authenticate with the appropriate account. Dang it, I did it. I should not be recording this late at night. <laughs> Click allow and it will create a folder. You can rename those to whatever, but I'm just gonna go ahead and complete integration. Be found there at a link that is blurred out. Whoa, fascinating. Anyway, that is more or less how you integrate Google Drive into JotForm. Apologies for the slight sarcasm in this video, but I hope you enjoy this video. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, I don't know why you would, give it a big thumbs up. You can click right over here to subscribe to their respective channels. And you can click right over here to see my previous video. And as always, I'll see you in the next tutorial. Bye bye